So me hearties, I have another upcoming project, uh, this time I want to show you just the bare frame because once I put in all the electronics it's, it's hard to see what I've done in there. So my mini H quad carbon fiber frame seems like the minis are taking over the world now. Uh, pretty much pretty much like the best fun thing to bash around between the trees. So uh, use the 12 mil carbon fiber booms uh, sunk in all together carbon fiber plates and I wrapped around with a with a fishing line it says braid or something whatever right at nine kilos or something well four and a half kilo pike can withstand definitely I know that for sure so uh, all the windings it looks looks more neat than one of my one of my previous one of my previous quads when I used the when I used the uh, carbon fiber treads that I had so don't mind this thing it's ready to go for trick-or-treating um, okay so the gear I didn't decide yet much about the motors um, thinking of uh, ZMRs but they have some magnet problems or something so uh, Turnigy Multistar 1900 kV they have a bit of a less of a power so we'll see we'll see we'll see didn't didn't make up my mind yet so there's gonna be uh, Afro NASA 32 board on uh, planning to get the Mobius and feed live as well but as much as I as much as I know they have a bit of a latency same as a same as a GoPro so not sure there could be could be the flying CCTV one of them uh, 600 TV lines cameras cameras as well for comparison there's a um, five and a half inch props uh, I'd say you can see better in my well, plan is messy already after working with carbon. There's a sort of a there's a five inch, five inch, five inch props. Planning to use five by four and a half tree blade props. Uh, maybe I'll mold a, a, a little bit of a cover to protect my protect my electronics there. So hopefully I will lift up something around 1500 tree cell tree cell battery uh, for the video plans to use this uh, little light 200 milliwatt uh, 5.8 gigahertz module have to build a clover leaf antenna for it so still keep on chasing my dream of the unbreakable quad frame <laughs> actually uh, the other one was supposed to be unbreakable but but I still broke still broke the arm because uh, when all the flying weight was uh, around 600 gram like it was going it was going pretty well like stuck a good few carrots and it was grand but then I started added on GoPro and then then OSD with GPS uh, a bit heavier battery so it was going going and and it became slightly too heavy to be unbreakable so uh, this one was built from the same 12 mil boom so should be should be this one unbreakable uh, let's put on the weighing scales. See, see what see what it shows in here. I have here 50 grams sharp. Ooh, heavy bastard. <laughs> sort of. Um, another thing, the motor mounts, the motor mounts that I put in there. Another thing that I started doing recently is trying to protect my motors because the last few crashes did not very very well for the motors. Uh, stuck in a gravel like rock gravel ground and he and he destroyed the motor belt so this time this time I'm trying to save a bit of a motor like the concept of it would be like just bash it around crash it change the props and up a go again so we'll see how will how will that how will that go like needless to say that there's bloody zero flexibility in the frame in there and what I'm gonna do with this frame another thing that I never done before I'm gonna test it for crashability basically gonna add on the dead weight on it and go around just throwing around and see what's it gonna be like if there's gonna be any cracks in the frame or any anything that I'm not gonna like it'll go back to the drawing board right so let's get outside and see how's it gonna withstand the crash okay okay very windy today weather's not liable so let's do the crash test
that's the unpleasant bit. Right, let's throw it up. Whoop. That's what you call a good carrot. Okay, let me see. This one looks all intact. That's the only bit that I will allow on this frame is to crack these bits and that's it. No more, no cracks in there, no nothing. Otherwise it won't be flying. in there no cracks even in there as I thought there would be okay all intact all intact we do one more time <laughs> 